This is my precious, no one can take it from me. Just like Gollum from The Lord of the Rings, who, after obtaining the One Ring, reveals his sinister true self, scheming to entrap the protagonists and ensure they can never take the ring away again. A similar scenario played out at the United Nations in the 1970s. The UN resolution restored the rightful place of the People's Republic of China in the UN, granting normal state status to another Chinese government long excluded due to the Chinese Civil War. But this marked the beginning of a nightmare for many countries. China, by distorting the content of Resolution 2758, not only claimed to be the sole legitimate government of China, but also aggressively suppressed nations that recognized Taiwan's sovereignty. Countries showing friendliness towards Taiwan face ruthless criticism or economic pressure from China. Meanwhile, nations that abandon Taiwan and acknowledge China not only find their economies entangled with China, but also see their domestic leaders become China's puppets, as if they were mere colonies of China. Remember the COVID-19 pandemic that erupted in 2020? It was a disaster brought to the world by China. Despite being isolated by China for so long, Taiwan made tremendous efforts to reach out and offer support, proudly declaring, Taiwan can help. The world cannot continue to let these 23 million people remain isolated. It's time to stand together and acknowledge Taiwan's contributions. China's global harm began with the distortion of Resolution 2758, using it to relentlessly exploit the world's resources for its gain. Should we continue to let China act with impunity? Isn't it time for them to face some consequences?